All right, so I woke up this morning and decided to try a quick experiment. I've had a number of people comment to me that the Model 3 does not have a battery pack heater. And um, however, uh, it, it does heat the battery. Now it heats it through inverter and motor um, current to warm the, uh, warm the coolant and run that through the battery pack. But you'll notice here that I've got it set to charge and it, it's drawing 32 out of, or excuse me, it's drawing 10 out of a potential 32 amps at 243 volts and a fraction of a mile per hour of charge time. So it skips up to one for a second and then goes back to zero for 10 or 15 seconds. So essentially it's really not putting any voltage into the battery, any current. So we've got 10 amps at 241 volts. So 2,410 uh, watts of, um, of available current power that's going into the battery, but the battery is really not charging or only at a, a tiny trickle. So that 10 amps at 242 volts is purely being devoted to warming the battery right now. So in case you guys are wondering at what rate the battery will warm itself to precondition uh, for charging, you're looking at, and that's pretty consistent, I've seen that before, at 10 amps at, uh, the, at the 240 some available volts. So anyway, just figured you guys would get a kick out of that. I know just super quick, uh, quick little video, not a whole lot of uh, scientific, uh, you know, uh, uh, experimentation here. It's just something I wanted to show you guys because uh, it's, it's something that I've had a number of comments on that, that don't you know that the Model 3 doesn't have a, a resistive heater to warm the battery, blah, blah, blah. No, it doesn't have a resistive heater. It warms up, it sends a... Uh, uh, a bit of, uh, of power through the inverter and through the motor to warm the inverter and the motor and to use that power to warm the battery. So anyway, um, that's what you're looking at. So just kind of a fun video for today. You guys have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye now.